morning, 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 five minute meditators. I hope that you have entered this month of May ready to begin to bloom and enhance your commitment to yourself and to the changes for your life. I hope that you rose this morning with gratitude and thankfulness for just another day, another year, another moment. I hope that as you are moving throughout this month of May, we tap into your level of commitment for the change that you need to be your best self. That's what this month is going to be about, is how can I commit and remain consistent in the commitment for my best life? You owe that to you. You owe that to you for just everything that you've gone through the sacrifices that you've made. So ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I am committed to understanding my needs. I am committed to understanding my needs. You can't expect others to give to you what you haven't allowed yourself to give to you. You have to understand what your needs are, what your desires are, what you feel like you are deserved, what levels of respect, your expectations, your boundaries. You have to commit to those things. You can't sway back and forward because when you sway back and forward, it gives a message to people that you aren't serious identify your commitments. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in and hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in and release. I understand and value my commitments. I understand and value my commitments. You may not fully understand them right now, but as you are going through the process, understanding your commitments, valuing yourself so that your commitments are important to you. They become a priority for you. They are justified for you. You're the only person that can make a commitment in your life and honor it. Only you. You've got the power to honor the commitment to yourself. Nobody else has to join the level of commitment to you. But what you do have to do is make it a requirement for them to be in your space. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds. And release. I honor the commitment and I extend it only to those that align with me. I honor the commitment and I extend it only to those that align with me. We are too busy in this naturalness trying to get everybody to be a part of our process. Everybody's not supposed to be a part of your process. Everybody isn't supposed to align with your visions, your goals, your dreams, your ideas. Everybody's not supposed to be in that pool. I'm a firm believer that your your truth is you get a few very close niche people. Everyone else is an extension of that, and they don't get the fullness. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. My level of commitment increases as I honor myself. My level of commitment increases as I honor myself. What are you going to challenge yourself with a commitment for in this month? What are you going to raise the vibrations for? Raise your energy level for? Raise your commitment level for in the month of May? Only you can decide that for your life. You'll see a lot of different motivational speeches, excuse me, and things like that that's out there. But only you can align yourself 
with the commitment for you. Don't get so wrapped up in others this month. Be about the business that you were created to be for. I see you. Namaste.